Hey folks, I'm Surveying Glory, and welcome to part 62 of my playthrough of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic. Starting off down at our an oil refinery, which is under construction. Um, eating up a lot of our money, having to buy in uh, asphalt and mechanical components. Yes, so costly, but once this is complete, then we'll be able to produce our own fuel and our own asphalt. Uh, and then that will eventually open up the way for our own mechanical components and electrical components. So this is the last piece really in the jigsaw for our self-sufficiency. Um, I've been thinking about the railway. We're going to set up something in here. This road is probably going to... There's the other uh, <laughs> snow plows that I was looking for. Um, yeah, anyway. Yeah, so this road is probably going to either disappear or be rerouted because I want this space for a railroad construction and loading etc and to that end we want storage from here uh, liquid storage what, actually, do I want anything special? I don't think so I think we're just going to go with the vanilla 1500 tons it's probably fine don't need any of this at this point so let's see how do we want this I could move one down here but can I not get them both in I flip it around but I want the road to come out this side right so we could do that um, now we're going to do this actually <laughs> power poles in the way, but the power poles are going to be moved, I've decided. So we could put that in there, and the road on the other side, yeah, like that. So we put you in about there. And can we connect you up? Please say yes. No. My God. We can connect you. At least let's get this shifted in. I want it to be in line with that other one if we could. But close are you? There, you're joined up there. Fine. And then if we stick in just uh, mud roads, well, we'll do that one later. But that's going to mean reeling that pipe as well. So be it. Let's if you just curve around here. And then you'll come down and connect up. Although I need to make sure I leave enough space for the pipe to descend. Yes. Let's have you Continue out like this thing. Come out to about there. Right. And then these pipes here. Uh, okay. Get rid of this. Continue that over. 
Can you not get down in there? Okay then. Come across to here. And then down like so. Paint. Then we'll have a real loading platform out here somewhere. Actually, missing all of that. Let's slow things down a bit. Uh, over here, survived quite nicely through the winter. We're now up to 261 residents here. 44% happiness, 47. So that's on its way up again. Up the hill, we've completed our mining village. 37 workers there. This one, well, actually, somebody's moved in. I just opened it up for people to come and live there. These staff there is fine. Live there. Actually, how many kids do we have up here? 19, 29, 40. I think we go for seven's probably enough for now. Seven staff, that is. We're almost the max there. We do have the max number of sailors here and then there. Forty workers there. But I'm going to bump that up a bit, just to make sure we've got plenty of space for workers. Still got tons of steel, despite having, what was it, 310 tons I think we needed for this. Right. Okay. It's so what I'm thinking about is... I need to wait until this is done. How long? Well, it depends on how quickly the steel gets there. Uh, let's have a look. What I'm looking for the uh, fossil fuel industry, the oil refinery. 12 megawatt hours of power. Right, uh, because of thinking about moving this substation, positioning it in here somewhere to cover that area. And this one here is probably fine. And we've got one up there, and one up here. I just want to improve my electrical grid. Try and avoid having as many power fluctuations and brownouts, as it were. 263, 45% happiness, 48, so that's increasing. Oh, food is coming again from the border. We did complete our warehouse, but don't have any green in it, uh, any food in it. So hopefully once the fields have been harvested later in the year, that will begin to fill up. And I did bring in another uh, covered hull and another tractor. So just at March, sowing is done. Growing is already a lot further on than I was expecting. I didn't assign the fields, god damn it. Uh, assign that and that. Rookie mistake. Got the tractors, and as you can see, I extended this line out here. When the basis out, if the tractors were out here, running out of fuel, they can just hop up there rather than come back over to the farm. You don't actually. You're not assigned. Uh, you should be. Police station, distribution, treatment, clinics, gas station, technical services. 
didn't assign the farm. Oh, there we go. Another rookie mistake. But anyway. Let me see, what could I do with the electricity while we wait? And we're going to have major construction in here. So we'll probably will want another substation up in that area for all the rail yards, etc. So, just looking at this entire mess in here. We're going to want uh, high voltage switches. What do you have? You've just got three. You have four way medium. You have transformer. And you've only got two. Transformer small. That's probably okay for in here. I really need to lay out my railway though before I start plopping these down. We could have that in there. It might suffice in terms of the medium. Yeah, the medium outputs. And then we'd have another down here. Again, you only need to put it somewhere down in there actually and have two medium outputs, one for here and one for over here. So what's different? What do we have in there? Small transformer medium. Right. So that's um Yeah, and that one. Yeah, so that's the problem, that we've only got medium wires coming down here. That's the problem I'm trying to solve. Yeah, yeah I think I need to lay out the railway construction, etc. And then that lets me see where I can run wires, run uh, place transformers. Still waiting for 67 tons of steel in there. Right. Right, I did put in this technical services now, so we're going to rehome all of those vehicles up to there. And I did in this just during the winter to get us through. So I'll get the snow ploughs moved. And again, we need to <laughs> add that into the mix too. Right, then we can get rid of that. And a bit of a road there. Demolish, yes. Can I work around that? I should be able to. Let's get rid of the path. That means the vehicles have to use that road. Once this is gone. Take away that. Okay. We can get rid of that path as well. That's a road, actually, not path. Alright. Wait till you get past the waypoint. 
could take out of this up there. Take out you two. No. Oh. Crash. Apologies. Okay. So, just recovered from a crash. Um, it was the first crash I've had in the game in I don't know how long. Um, and I think it was because the game panicked when I deleted the last section of road here. They didn't know what to do with the vehicles. But fortunately, the last autosave was only the 28th of March, so we only lost a wee bit of time. So, yeah, we've got the road cleared, we've got our uh, free technical services out of the way these fields are going. Uh, and then you should go and work on those three, I would hope. Um, but yes, so. Now that that road's gone, I can lay in my fuel loading. So, trains, oil fuel loading, and... That's it to connect. That's got to be the other way around for in. Try and get it roughly central. Do that and pipes from here to here works fine, from there to there, fine as well. And the road obviously has to be on the other side, so we'll probably just have a road that comes in as straight as possible, like so. Right, okay, and over on the other side of the road we'll have, um, let me see, well the other cargo loading and a depot, just for the look of the, this is more, uh, depot is more decorative really than anything else, a bit long Train depot. That's a bit too big, I think. Yeah, I like that one. So, if we can just set you in something like. Uh, like that, I suppose. And we'll move you as far back as we can, remembering that the power lines are going to be moved. So we could fit you in there. Extend this road further. I don't know if we'll go that far. It's actually pretty much following the track of the previous road. I could have left it in after all. Never mind. Uh, what do I want here? Oh yeah, I was thinking about loading. So we would want, let's see, cargo station. Do we have a one-sided one? We do. And I don't want you coming out of the depot. The, the rail line. But we could actually just sit it like that. That would be fine. Uh, and actually there, so that you've got some power, but remember we're going to move that, so that, but that's okay. I think I like... Um, no, I don't. I don't like that at all, because we need to get our storage in first. So I want some sort of warehouse and some sort of open storage. That. Could end you in there. Try that. 
As long as the road connects, we're okay. It does. And what else was I thinking? Not vehicles. Open storage. I don't really have what I'm looking for here. That I think is too big. Tell you what, let's get this in and then we'll decide what ah, but then that's going to block off the depot. I think we need to move the depot actually. Let's delete you. Where did the road go? Put it in. Um, yeah, so we need to get the station in. And probably like that. Yeah. What about the road though? The road connection. We just have to work around that. So if that's fine there, and then we go to storage. Nothing there. Do I just need to go for a medium storage? I suppose 1170 tons of steel would be alright. But. Hmm. I need something more like that. Do I want something that big? Small one might be a bit better. And again, just shift the road. Plenty of space down there, let's do that. Get rid of you and go back to our storage. And if we can fit you in here. Yeah, it'll do. Can I possibly drag the road out? No, not quite. I could move that along. And then we could bring a road down there. Or I could download some better storage from the mod uh, in the workshop. Mm. It's not that, it's I definitely need something from in the storage. That's got to be something from here. Way too big. Again, we need to move the What infrastructure's preventing you? Uh, the road. Okay, there's always that then. Do this. I put that. 
No, because it blocks off the, the rails down here. Harum. Okay. Try... What was it I was working with? These don't have rails, do they? Yes, it does. Oh, no, no, it's the... Yeah, it's the... Uh, factory forklift connection that we're looking for. And again, the rails are in the way. That's why I was looking for the one from the side. Yeah, the same. It's got to be this. I might have to go and download something different. Good to look for another storage, something that can fit in there. Uh, but let's have a quick look at what we might do with the rails. So we would also want something straight to begin with. Let's make sure we leave plenty of space to the left. are in the way. What do I want to connect in? Let's leave that there for now. Because we've got this junction up here. Uh, let's get rid of those. And we need Uh, switch over to there. Not too long. Like that. And then... It's going to have to be something like that I think and then from there it would sneak in there I think I could live with that yeah okay and does this track then connect in here or do I have something else? I think we'll try that out. It's too tight to have something else. We need to use this wind spur here. So let's see if you were to hit something like that. And you came out there. Well, that's fine. Yeah, that's looking okay. And then if we look at our depot. So I was going with this long train depot, I think. And... I just wanted to turn that way around so that the road's facing the right direction. And now do I want that to connect up with the rail? Don't know. I don't know, do I want that? Do I want to connect directly up from one platform or from the platform into the depot? I suppose we could. It doesn't matter, but again, it needs the electricity pylons taken out of the way. 
The alternative is obviously something like this. And I could run the reel on for a siding. Maybe just do that. Yeah, let's settle for that. And connect you up to that point. I was hoping for some sort of little curvy road there. Let's do it that way instead. Right, okay. I'm going to leave it here for now. We'll pick this up again next time out. Try and get some of this sorted out. And if I get another um, storage downloaded, that would be great. But before we go, let's have a quick check in here. 260 workers, good. 44%, 49%. So that's... Yeah, hang on, somebody was... Oh no, missing food. That was over here, I'm sure. That was the warning from there. Uh, these are all growing, thankfully. Not too far behind, but that's good. Uh, and up here... Still 37. 17 in there, though. And... Culture... is the only real problem. The lack of culture. Nickel Thorny. There are plenty of workspaces available. People are looking for them. And one more in here, just for now. And we'll add in a couple there. Right. But as I said, I'm going to put in a break. What are we doing here? <laughs> Before we go. Getting there. Okay. So, yes. Time for a break. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please leave me a comment or rate the video. Subscribe to the channel if you enjoy the content. And hope to see you again next time. Cheers.